Hello everyone, my name is Fable and welcome back to Broken Age. In the last episode we met this wolf and helped him navigate the ship to another area and saved some people but also had to sacrifice someone because we couldn't save everyone in time. So let's continue. Excuse me, Merrick, what are you doing? There's no time to waste. Take that vent to the navigation room and give that star chart to the space weaver right now. Chart. They did not save everything, even though it's safe. Or is it about a new area? Oh, wait, I need to give it to you. Hey, Space Weaver, can you take me here? Excellent choice, young sir. For preparing the decryption mechanism. Initializing warp. Okay, we should be in Danger System 5. Are we ever? Take a look at this. Well, for some reason it doesn't save, or we are in a new area. Need to lower the shield so the boom arms can be extended. Careful. Excellent. Securing subject and cargo hold. Go on. Move the ship. Don't worry. She won't detect our moving the ship. I've covered our tracks very well. Wait for it. Great work. Don't wait forever, though. Good. But hurry, we're running out of time. Oh, wait. We are in another system Go now. On, move the ship. Rats. Okay, that's enough. What do you mean, that's enough? I mean, enemy ships are approaching. I don't see anything. I need to save this last one. You're going to endanger the whole mission to save one creature? Just give me a second. This is a waste of time. There is no need for this. Okay. I got it, but something's wrong. Cut it loose. We need to retreat before. Oh. Attention, ship is under attack. What happened? Probably one of the enemy vessels I warned you about, remember? We need to get that last creature. Too late. The ship is retreating under autopilot to a safe location. And we're completely locked out of the control. Yeah. How are we going to perform any more rescues? We'll have to find another way to hack into the boom arm controls and another way to bring the shields down at the right time. And who knows if we'll be able to navigate to the right system now that the ship's on high alert. The ship's computer must be freaking out right now. Oh, yes. <laughs> as soon as the alarm sounded, the first thing she probably did was check on you and your... Maybe she doesn't recognize us. Oh. I thought that maybe. Shay, are you hurt? I thought that maybe she was going to be convinced that our puppet was the real one and we had to convince her somehow that we aren't an imposter. Because some games would do that. But I guess it's not the case here. Do we get to play the other mini game now? Whew. Better get back to Merrick to hear his plan. Ah, the wolf's name is Merritt. Okay. Wait, is it already day? You must come see me right away. 
Another distress signal has arrived. I guess not. I guess we won't get to play this Alva mini game. Now it's about the octopus creatures. No, but we intercepted a new distress signal, this time from Prima Doom. The distress call was from Prima Doom? How do we get there? Same as always. Take this star chart to the Space Weaver and hope for the best. I'm still convinced that we are kidnapping people. So, how long have you been living in here? I am a recent stowaway. I came because I sensed you were ready. Are you really a wolf? No, I wear this disguise to blend in with your other stuffed animal friends. Weird. Wait, so we are in a ship with a furry. We need to get to the Death Star. So that's a wolf suit? What are you underneath? I am what I do. A rescuer of creatures in need. Just like you. Sure. Why do I have to be the one to choose who to rescue? A boy your age just has good instincts for the job. I'd better get back to the mission. Yes. Our window of opportunity won't last forever. We need to go here right away. Prima do. Negative. That system is forbidden due to likelihood of hostile activity. But it's an emergency. Sometimes safety is the most exciting venture of all. Might I suggest somewhere safer, like Puppy Planetoid, Cozy Cluster, or me, somewhere in the Smile System? No way. I have to go to Prima Doom right now. Lives depend on it. I'm sorry, young master, but my programming won't allow it. Forget it. If we can't go to Prima Doom, I don't want to go anywhere. Please don't be angry, young sir. If I could override this directive, I most certainly would. Now we need to hack it, I guess. Son, I'm not sure it's safe enough for you to leave your room. I'm tired of being a prisoner in my room. I'm sick of being a prisoner on this ship. I know, son. I know it's hard. You've given up so much. Listen, I'd like to tell you a story. A story of another person your age. A young girl. She wanted to live a normal life, but she was chosen. She was honored with a special duty. Some people Is it going to cut to her life now? She didn't realize at the time was that it was a great and there we probably also have a mother who will talk about this boy if he chose her storyline at the beginning. Sacrifice girl is you, right? What I'm trying to tell you is that I made a hard choice, but I regret nothing because great story, computer. I'm sorry they programmed you with someone's sad memories, but I have to go. You know the truth deep down, son. And I know you'll appreciate my words someday. Uh-huh. Brother. Computer, we need to get to Prima Doom immediately. Absolutely not. They call it Prima Doom for a reason. Why not have some fun in the smile system instead? So what does Dad do during the day? Oh, your father has a lot of work to do outside, you know? Fixing the hull, scraping off space parasites, keeping a lookout for new planets to live on. Computer, what's the point of all this? Son, you know how important Operation Dandelion is. No, I don't. Paul Maruna was dying. 
So we set sail on the Vasa Nostra to travel the universe and to find you a new home. Why haven't we found a new home yet? Well, the universe is a big place, and it has to be perfect for my baby. Well, I gotta get back to taking over the ship. <laughs> oh, sweetie, you're so funny. I'm not joking. Yes, my love. Oh, no. Um, I just tried to click on the little thing. And maybe we can get it with the grab thingy we got. This thing? No. What do we have here? Is this our bedroom? No. She'd leave something this dangerous lying around. A knife? What's that? Nothing. Nothing. And now we also have a knife. You don't talk too, do you? Not unless I have something to say. Please ignore him, sir. Bad attitude. This knife is more edgy. Yeah, this one was bad. Please don't. Please don't leave my chat. <laughs> can we eat? Not going back in there if I can help it. Wait, can I leave the spoon? Stay on alert. I think there might be food around. Always, sir. No. But with the knife, I can cut things. Hey, why won't this open? Oh, honey, you can't come in here. I'm working on a surprise for you. What is it? Nice try. Mm. Is this our bedroom? It is, okay. Can we steal more things? What's this? She says it's a humidifier, but I think it's some sort of mind control device. Either way, it's dead now. I took away its food source. I do hate that humidifier, but not enough to wreck my knife. Dad? I'm warning you. Don't fall in love with me. It was dead for a moment. I've tried throwing a towel over that thing, but she always pulls it off. Creepy. Health stats 100% normal. As always, maybe I'm the robot. Now, what other rooms do we have available? What is this? Teleporter, activate. Yes, sir. To the Hall of Heroes. You mean the junk room? Yeah. <gasps> it kind of killed us right now. Because teleportation disassembles and reassembles my, our body. My head. What's which means wrong? killing. My head is smaller. Oh uh, yeah, you just used a teleporter. Why did my head shrink? Quantum physics. Duh. Don't worry, it'll all go back to normal when you take the trip back through me. Big baby. Is there a path? away from this without using the teleporter and could we just shrink our head till it becomes super tiny I wonder what's in those creepy jars my old teeth hair I made a hexi pal out of a paper plate probably thought they were alive then I never want to see another train as long as I live 
we'll probably see a lot of trains. I gave up making art years ago. If no one's around to see it, who cares? As soon as we get full control of this ship, I'm going to burn this stuff. As soon as we get full control of this ship, I'm going to burn this stuff. How did I manage to win second place that time? I think that's the ratty old washcloth I used to drag around the spaceship. I really hope she washed that thing. She bronzed my first space shoes. Or is that the remains of my old bomb squad bot? I wish she'd get rid of these. My paper mache is so much better than that now. Hey, the helmet comes off. Ah, my first hazard suit. Kept out, Amic. That should be for acting. Acting like I cared about the stupid missions on this ship. Can we steal the teddy? No. Judging by the wolf hair, this must be where Merrick sleeps. The helpless creatures we rescued are being quarantined in there. Wish I could let them out, but it's for their own safety, I guess. The Space Weaver won't make a nav scarf for Prima Doom. Hmm. How are your knitting skills? I'd better get back to the mission. Yes. Our window of opportunity won't last forever. Actually, going to try out if we can get our head smaller and smaller. Hey, what are you trying to do? Uh, teleport? You already went through me, but you didn't teleport back through me. So? So your head is still messed up. You can't go through again, or it will get worse. You have to teleport back through me the other way, so your head goes back to normal size. So many rules on this ship. Your head is more important than you realize, Shay. Sorry, I can't let you through until you make a return trip with me first to restore your head. Mm. Oh, they actually thought about that. Okay. Teleporter, activate. This way to the Fusion Orb Containment Facility. Not responsible for lost items, motion sickness, or mutations. Okay, now my head is just getting ridiculous. Oh boy, you went through two teleporters with our return trip, didn't you? You're playing with fire, kid! I wonder if I can actually die in this game. Caution, entering an area of strong Omicron radiation levels. All radiation shielding necessary to proceed. Lay it on me. my helmet that's just great my head is almost small enough to fit in this helmet now okay i need to go through another teleporter so it's actually intended so it's actually intended to shrink our head Remember to come back through the way you came to avoid dangerous cranial alterations. Warning. Objects placed into this trash chute will be jettisoned from the ship. And the next time it happens to one of your toys, Shay, your father is not going to retrieve it for you. Huh. You crawl into something once when you're two years old and they lock it forever. Are 
What happens if I grab it anyway? Can't I ride the train again? So we are banned from the train now. Wait, what's that? Oh, I thought that maybe it would be something valuable. Ah, this is the ice cream room. Must be the high alert. I'll bet Mary can hack into it. I don't want to stab that. I do. What's behind this door? Ah, huh, this is the ice cream room. Thought that maybe it would be behind the other doors. Also, what was that? wanted to see what you guys were up to. Look at all that ice cream. Don't try to steal it. Can I grab it? Uh, Gary prefers to grab frozen yogurt. Do we really need all that whipped cream? Yeah, to keep you away from that ice cream up there. There's no stopping you in that too. Don't see anything there I want to eat. I'm going to go eat all that ice cream. I don't care. I don't care. Don't you have anything else to do? Just making sure you're safe. What is this room? Fake controls. What a surprise. Hey, can we run the attack mission protocol? Sure. I think I know what you need. I'm aboard the distressed vessel Friendship Circle. I found one of the crew. He's been attacked enough. What happened here? From an enemy vessel? Or an alien creature? Or did you attack yourselves in a fit of space madness? Yes. Oh. Wait. Is there something on your head? Missions are cancelled. You can drop the act. Hey, maybe I can fix your back. Really? Yeah, I think I see what's wrong. Hold still. Oh, yes. and is, this an, is this a sickle? You're welcome. Well, I gotta go. Yeah. Hmm. I wonder if I could knit with this. Actually, it's a crochet hook, so you could probably crochet with it. Wow, you know a lot about yarn crafts. Wolf costumes don't make themselves. 
fake controls. What a surprise. Oh. Now I know how to get out. Ah. Now I get it. Teleporter, activate. To the starboard passageway, sir. No malfunction, no malfunction, no malfunction. Remember to come back through the way you came to avoid dangerous cranial alterations. Yes, we get to keep our tiny head. How much smaller will my head get? Teleporter, activate. This way to the fusion or containment facility. There is no time. I think that's all my head can take. You need to make a return trip through me right away, Shay. In a minute. Yes, now the helmet should fit. machine is just never going to give me a helmet. What a ripoff. Hey, my head is the perfect size for this helmet now. A little snug, but I think it will work. Not sure how long I can stand the spoiled milk smell though. Now we can take this crystal. That fusion orb powers the ship's shield, which is critical because we get attacked by enemy spaceships constantly. That fusion orb powers the ship's shield, which is critical because we get attacked by enemy spaceships constantly. Nah, Gary doesn't like to grab slippery things. Gotta keep this thing on ice so it doesn't cause a meltdown, I guess. This tiny suit wouldn't be much use there, or anywhere. That fusion orb powers the ship's shield, which is critical. How do I take this away? So it doesn't cause a meltdown, I guess. I don't want to pick a fight with the fusion orb. It's very powerful. We could take it. The fusion orb is more than a spoonful, and also it's radioactive or something. I don't see how that would make this helmet bigger, or my head smaller, for that matter. I don't know how I would crochet that. I don't think that That's going to be it for today's video. Please like and subscribe to support me and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.